Hi guys, welcome back to Chubby Place. So today we'll be taking a look at another deck from Unified Minds, which is Dun uh Nomadium Z Tackle Deck. Well, I'm not really excited about this because regardless of a GX attack. Uh, the Pokemon that can use this Nomadium Z is only Pokemon that can use Tackle Attack, so it's very limited and frankly, they are not that good. So yeah, but since it's a new mechanism, you have the new Z Crystal in your Unified Mind, so why not? Might as well try it, right? And the post rotation format, I've taken a look at a few Pokemon that has Tackle and I think I decided uh, I'm going to try it with Camera Rub. So this Camera Rub itself also comes from Unified Minds. What's good about this is it's a fire type. So we can actually use Welder for the energy acceleration. I mean, normally MZ, the Z moves or the GX attack also requires 4 energy. So we still need a lot of energy acceleration. And I think Welder is a good choice to start the... Tackle, GX, Shenanigan, and that's why I choose Camera. And another support Pokemon that we have here will be Zap Striker. So Zap Striker is just because you want more draw mechanism. And the other one is just in case I had a Basculin with Tackle. So why I put this in the deck is because the Swarming Bites does 20 damage for each Basculin you have is a colorless attack. So I've taken a look at other Pokemon that have Tackle as an attack, right? I think Basculin is the most flexible one. So I was thinking, okay, might as well just put in this deck for now. So the other card from this deck is more or less the usual thing that you will see on a fire deck. You have your fiery flint, drop to get four energy cards, fire crystals, get energy cards from this card, Pokegear, a stable card for four standard format in 2020 switch because you have four retreat costs and you won't and you won't be able to retreat with the energy honestly yeah uh the, your usual custom catcher because no guzma and giant heart the stadium that is new for fire type that drop a card get two fire energy hit factory of course prism star card Stadium card for more extra draw and Brock Grids also becomes very important in most decks because there's no more rescue stretcher. Four copies of Welder, Green's Exploration, Tate and Liza for extra drawing mechanism, and I have another item here which is buff padding. So Numa and Camera itself has four retreat costs, and I think. Since it's going to be a so-called pretentious GX Pokemon with one price card, so it definitely needs more HP. And sometimes after we had used the GX attack, maybe the buff padding will become very useful in order to get plus 50 HP. So we can increase like from 140 to 190. I think there's barely any GX or okay, not including tag team GX, of course, there's barely any GX or non-GX Pokemon that can kill camera up in one hit if that's the case so yeah that's more or less about this deck i tried a bit and of course <laughs> what do you expect from this kind of deck even the second attack is actually not that strong but well since they give it to us let's go ahead and try this deck okay Alright, so let's move on to our first match. Like I said, I'm not very excited about this deck. Really? I don't expect to win, I guess. It's not really a bad deck, but if we go against current meta right the tech team the very fast tech team i think we will definitely lose okay but let's just see what we can do here
Okay. Hmm, my computer has been laggy. I hope that it's not really laggy this time. Mm, I think I can set up the best string and no mouse. Alright. Okay, I'll drop the fire energy in the buff setting because we don't need it now. Okay, get four fire energy and so we can use well the why the card description keeps coming up. I wonder why the card descriptions keep coming up, but... Okay, is it because I'm not playing with mouse? Let me take out my mouse and... Uh, okay. I think I'll just put the normalium key here, because why not? The problem is, next turn we don't really have any draw supporter. Let's just hope he doesn't take out the... Hit factory then. Oh, okay, it's a pre rotation deck. Well, the more that I think we won't win against this. But let's just try. Okay, Charizard and Reshiram. Okay, so the opponent is using the meta deck again. Charizard and Reshiram. Charizard and Reshiram not as fast as Pikachu and Chrome, I believe. Or maybe they are around the same. Where's my mouse? But I'm really hoping we can kill the Charizard Reshiram with the Normalium Z. We actually have the chance. Okay, if they retreat. Now I just need to be wary of Guzma because since they're playing pre-rotation, they should have a Guzma. But at least I don't need to worry that they will take out my Heat Factory. No, he actually took out my heat factory. Okay, fine. Okay, at least we draw another welder. So that's good. Okay, let's see how many cards we have here. Are you okay? Okay, we have two fire energy. Fire energy. Hmm, I don't really want to welder on this one, but okay. How much damage does it do? Oh, no chance. Let's just welder one of the energy. I just want to draw. Okay. Not use Jim's exploration this turn. Mm, not really good, but two hundred and seventy HP. Okay, now the problem is actually don't know how to kill the. Canyon in front. I knew it. 
a post rotation deck not fun to uh, I mean a pre rotation deck not fun to go against with. Huh? Let's see what we can draw first. Highly claimed an adventure back for nothing because we took out all the items already. Yeah, let's get Okay, we really need to draw the Pokemon this turn. We really need to draw our camera up this turn, then we can prepare for well the I mean, we need a new mail. How to get a new mail? There's no way to draw it, is it? I think I need to run a Pokecom. Yeah, so since there's actually no way for me to draw with. I'll uh, just draw two welders. Mini G box heading. And I guess I need to start biting the Jirachi in this case. I'm surprised he actually used Moo Moo Milk, but luck not there. At least I have quite a bit of drawing mechanism next turn. I hope I can get the Numel by Speed Factory. The problem is just this match is simply unfair because of the Guzma. So if, the, if we take out the second Guzma to take out my second Numel, right, I uh, will actually rage quit and just concede this game. Ah, uh, not going to bother with it. Oh, wait. Oh no, I should have charged just now. Oh, wait. Did you escape, bro? Hmm, I can't believe he actually has keep rope. Problem is, I don't actually know how to deal with this Pokemon. Okay, let's go for Heat Factory first. Let's use a welder to charge. Okay, at least I got a custom catcher for next turn. I can definitely use no million C. Then I the problem is we don't get any new mail, so this is still quite bad, but I just want to use the no million Z. Give me the chance to use it. I don't think the opponent stack runs judge, so let's just kill that thing and hope for the best. <laughs> I really get to melt. I don't know why I I feel that this becomes a very funny match. Okay, Vaseline, do your job. We got a new mouth. How many fire energies do I have here? 
seven. Uh, not a time of our crystal yet. Uh, okay. So, I can mark it this, right? But I think it doesn't matter, isn't it? I will go for this one. Oh, okay. Let me do it. Let me do my normal Z tackle. Okay, 400 damage to Rishiram and Charizard. <laughs> that was satisfying. And that's basically the end of this deck. <laughs> well, yeah, <laughs> that's basically the end of this deck. So I mean, as I mentioned, I guess the extent of this deck is you can kill one big tag team GX and that's it. But uh, that's really what I feel. <laughs> and that's really what happened in this game. Then after this, I'm uh, really not sure what I can do anymore. I think the Reshiram and Cherishot can one hit everything, so there's no way that I can win this game, but. I'm satisfied enough. Yep. Definitely satisfied enough to be able to kill the Charizard. Freaking Vaseline. But I'm done. Okay, that was our first game, so I guess I cannot say that the, the Nomadium Z is bad, it's just that the Pokemon that goes with it is not really the best. Maybe if you can get a better Pokemon that can use Tackle, hmm? maybe it will work better. But we'll see, let's just do another match. I'm not very keen in doing a lot of match with this deck, so. We see how it goes. Okay, this time we actually got a bit slow to start. So it's quite okay, I would say. It just depends on what we can get from our bookies here. Okay, our opponent is. Ooh. Oh, okay, I think it's a Blessed Salon deck. Fire type, Ultra Beast, then. Yeah.
Okay, next ball. So again, we're actually going against a uh, pre-rotation deck. Not something that I'm keen to play against, but what to do? Okay, I'm actually going to fire plane over two procedure, I guess. Should I? Okay, hmm. is there any other supporters that I need? Green? The problem is well that is very very important in this set. Yeah, shouldn't have tried for it. Uh I Can I afford to do this? If I fail again, the problem is if I fail again, then next turn I'll be quite screwed. Never mind, I have to do it. Four, four energy card, put two hand. I actually charge one energy there just in case. If he survives, there's actually a very hard chance he survives, I would say. Okay, that's quite good. We got Zeph Shrika for next turn. Okay. I don't think I need to put down the blade so, so let's get it done this time. Oh, wait, I should have just tackled it. But I think it doesn't really matter, so... Oh well. Mm, if the opponent is the non-GX deck, it'll be a problematic for us because that means we need to try to attack with the camera up as much as possible. Oh, it actually has welder. What kind of deck is that? It's only basic, right? Yeah, basic Pokemon. Mm, I'm not risking it to the front anymore. Actually, I am risking it. I got two energy and a welder. Green. Course, what are the chances? I don't really need Brock, but what to do? I think I shouldn't have taken the Brock, then I can just sprint again next turn. Yeah, tackle for 10 damage. So, opponent's deck not very fast, our deck not very fast, and this is what happened. We're just both setting up our stuff. I'm not even sure what is happening. Not even sure if it's... Oh, actually he's going to attack, right? Because then he can feed the energy to the Naganadels behind. It's just... Is it a Naganadal fire variant? How easy you play Naganadal with Quagsire because Quagsire can move your energy and that's why it's strong. I think about it, the Quagsire is quite similar to the Turtonator. Its attack will increase with the number of energies you have. Oh, he actually only drops one. Did he drop one or drop two? Okay. I got a costume catcher. And 
I'll use a custom catcher because why not? And I actually draw a camera. Uh, I mean, I actually plan to tackle it. Here, I can tackle and I can shuffle. Ah. Tackling it like nobody's business. Oh, wait. Do you not need to drop from your from your Pokemon? I see. I guess that's the reason why Tertonator is strong. Is he going to kill my camera? He needs 4 energy though. Not sure if he remembers that he needs 4 energy or not. <laughs> I'm actually just hoping that he forgot. And that means I got more turn to... Okay, he doesn't forget. Of course. At least we can tackle him. Uh, put the energy here. I don't even need no medium C, but I guess that's the reason why I feel like I should just throw it away as well. Put the buff padding here. Change first. Welder, please. Good. I don't think I need a switch at this point of time. I need my fire crystals soon. Hmm. This is one time that we actually got a lot of Vaseline. That's very interesting. I don't think I'm going to use my custom catcher now. Okay, let's see. 130 HP so we can one hit. Tackle. I found this becomes a very funny match. So the opponent's deck itself is very weird. My regret is that I actually dropped a switch. Okay, I dropped one switch, I should have one more switch. Uh, I'm thinking whether I should go for the skill for the poipo. Or if it's actually going to go for the skill for the switch alternator. Hi, so I realized, I guess, the opponent's deck is actually very strong. Okay, what to do now?
I'm actually just going to snipe the Poipo since it has become like this. I'm not going to do anything. Because I really don't want to drop my custom capture. And I really don't want to drop more fire energy. I want my fire crystal. Let's check first. We have... We don't have any fire crystal there, but... But yeah, I guess for now we can just slowly cheat them off. Okay, so let's see how many welders they already used. They already used two, so I believe they should have two more. But I'm not sure if they actually have fire energy in hand. Oh, you use up everything? Hmm, so I don't think he actually got the welder. At least, you know, I can take my time <laughs> to be keeping his best clean. Why is he doing that? Okay, fire crystal is going to draw more cards. Sounds like it. I don't really have a lot of cards left. Mm, but I still need to weld the... So, it's a bit of a problem. Okay, I actually got custom capture, so that's very good. I should start charging. One, two, three. Yeah, I don't think I have any more... Fire energy in my deck, but I should have more fire crystals, so I think I would wait and I would actually keep off that Turtonator there. I'm not sure if he's going to run out of cards. And I wonder if he has switch. I'm going to custom capture the Alolan Mark and kill off this Turtonator. Okay, you need two energy for me. At this point, I'm just hoping that he has no switch. Let's see what we have left. We got Jay and Liza, we got Welder. Okay, and two fire crystal. That's the thing that I need. I need a two fire crystal. Okay, I didn't want to do the welder the previous turn because I'm actually just hoping that he doesn't have switch. So if he doesn't have switch, I get... Okay, Guzman is worse because free rotation, right? Time to concede. Ah, uh, I got very irritated when 
I lose because of a pre-rotation and post-rotation things. And I guess I should have tried it after they implement the post-rotation, but I need to try. Yeah, so I think I'm done with this deck for now. We haven't, actually we haven't gone against the post-rotation deck, right? Never mind, let's try one more match. Mm, let's hope this time it will be really a post rotation deck because otherwise we can't really know whether this deck is good I mean we all know that it's not good but whether this deck is actually playable or not but actually the previous match was quite good I'm actually quite impressed Okay, hand is so so. I don't have a lily as long as I remember, so this hand is a bit weird. Oh, never mind, we are going against another pre rotation deck. Should have expected it, um, but what to do? And it's another Charizard and Restaurant. Okay, the good thing about this is I can hope that I can caught them off guard. With a normal MZ. And at least my best clean can attack a Charizard on the first turn. <laughs> so it actually matters so much, but why not? Okay, Fire Flame for Fire Energy and. Um, I'm. Actually, I don't know what I'm hoping to get. Well, the fine. I will the one energy to the best clean because I don't want to waste so much energy. Uh, giant horse for extra energy draw, I guess. Um, the problem is. I think I'm dead. <laughs> if the opponent managed to switch and attack next turn with the Charizard, then that's it. That's game. Uh, I think I realized the problem with this deck is the green does not actually help to search Pokemon so much. So the Pokemon searching mechanism in this deck is very bad. Maybe I should have added Pokemon Fan Club instead. Or oh, the other thing that I can use is Pokemaniac, I think. Because Numel and Camera both have 4 retreat costs. So Pokemaniac will work. Yeah, but after a few games, I realized it's really the Pokemon drawing mechanism is quite bad. Your green does not help you because. There's not much that you can take. Mm, I mean, if it works as other fire type deck, then the green should be used to you to find Heat Factory. Then I can draw more. I hope you get my Pokemon. But then again, it's not guaranteed that you get a Pokemon. So yeah. Actually, uh, something that I'm still unsure of, if I use, okay, this one obviously I'll take a welder and the heat factory. If I use the giant hearse and put down the heat factory, can I still use the heat factory? Let's try it. I mean, Oh, I only have one fire energy left. Yeah, I can still put down the heat factory. But I still don't draw any Pokemon. Because... 
just because, right? I still haven't drawn any Pokemon. So, again, one more turn. Uh, we'll form bites on the Tapu Lele because camera up does 150. So, if you want to one hit it just in case, then I have to do it. Does he not actually have Welder? If he has Welder, oh, uh, if he has Welder and he can retreat, means, okay, I don't think he has it. The funny thing is we actually managed to survive with one Vaseline there. I think he'll be wondering, like, what is happening on our side? Why are we not doing anything? Can you give, can you give me more Vaseline? No, the Zap Strike card is useless. Ah. Not even sure what I should be doing, but I really need to draw more cards. Put more energies on you because why not? How many welders have I used? Okay, at least. Okay, no, actually, I've used two welders, so it's not very good. First, soft padding, fish. Huh? Small Charmander. Oh, it's opponent's deck. He got red handy. Hmm, but what is he going to do? Hmm, actually I'm wondering why he choose to. Really? He choose to do that? That's actually quite interesting. He doesn't even kill. But if I evolve it now, right, there is no point. Hmm. Is that the point that I have? A lot of Vaseline. Um, thinking whether I should custom catcher. I don't want to custom catcher now. I'll put down the. No, I have Zoom, so I won't put down the Zest Tracker. I'll put down my buff padding here. Put down a fire energy on the other Vaseline for surprise attack. Yeah, and I switch. And bite. Should I bite on the Jirachi? Or should I bite on the, uh, I shall bite the Charmander first. Now I wanna get green so I can get my fire crystal. Okay, not sure if I can get a welder in time. So, take that out. Do I evolve that? Evolve for more HP? I see fire crystal. 
should still have a welder there. Yeah, I know I have three fire crystals. But hand is bad. Put down the basculine because why not? Uh hand is just bad. But at least I need a fire energy this turn. Why is this not so consistent? Mm. Ah. Yeah, I'm actually just going to press done. Mm, so opponent actually used out a lot of energy from, yeah, I used out a lot of his energy, but I'm not sure how many energies he actually run in his deck. So, uh, since the opponent's deck is not exactly fast, it's not exactly very good, but he actually decided to march it all fine. Is it that he actually run out of fire energy? Okay, what do I need? I need a welder and a fire crystal. Wait, a normalium Z, yes. Do I have it in my hand? No, so I need a welder and a medium Z. So next turn most will be I'll uh, be able to kill this one. Uh I will fire crystal once more. I don't think he has another marshal though, shouldn't be right. Okay, no, I think I wouldn't go for it. There are three energies. Mm, I think I should put one in the camera. Up. Yeah, so done for now. I should have okay, I should have one more fire crystal in set, so Yeah, the problem is I don't have switch. I think he's looking for a switch. Then if he got the switch out, he will be able to attack with the Charizard and Vest Ram. Okay, three fire energies, but it's not in deck, so the Charizard is practically useless. I think this is the moment he realized that his Charizard is useless.
This is hard. So we actually got switch. Okay, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to start attacking with Vaseline again because I can heal this Salamander. So I'm going to switch to a new Vaseline. Put an energy here. Oh, I feel so bad, I should have switched with Ted and Liza. I guess at this point, I'm just going to keep attacking with Vaseline until that Charizard Reshiram came out. Yep, so the Charizard Reshiram comes out. I'm going to do the things that you won't expect. <laughs> so the funny thing is this is actually quite fun to do. <laughs> Caught him off guard. Okay. Normalian V. Well the And put an energy there. He killed two of my Vaseline, mm -hmm. right? Yeah, so let's just put a numeral here, because why not? And... Do I buy a crystal? Do I giant her? Uh... Uh, nope, it's just kill. Do a lot of damage! Yep. I can't believe, do I actually win this game? Okay, now let's see. Uh, of course, not sure yet whether I'm winning this game or not because he still has one more thing and I don't really have any attackers left. Other than my camera, of course. He also doesn't have a lot of attackers. But I think I'm winning this game. I can't believe this. This is just funny. Okay. Uh, okay, go camera up. I have no more Vaseline, and, but I'll take them back. Okay, I'm going to hope for Welder, so let's try first. No? Do I not have any more Welders? Okay. So apparently I don't have any more welders. Oh, uh, okay, I can really go out of the game. Uh, but since that's the case, I think I, ha I just have to wait until he ran out of gas. Uh, nothing that I can do. Yeah, not much that I can do. I'm sure you're just going to tackle this Charizard. This actually becomes more problem than I thought. So I still might not win this game.
Okay, I guess next turn I'm just going to Brock Squid and get all my best clean back. Hoping for my camera up to just die. Or oh, I can stay in Eliza next turn and take out all my new best clean. Then I can kill whatever behind. Yeah. I should be good. Uh, but I can only take out three best clean. Yeah, so let's do that. Brawl script. Get back the three best clean. And I guess three energy cards. Done. Fire crystal so I can use the heat factory. And get more fire energy cards or... I'm actually going for his here because I want to tackle the... Vixie knee if he's actually killing me next turn. Then. Yeah, I think he know he lose already because he don't have enough fire energy. Okay, so it's amazing that we actually won with this deck. That's very interesting, but I mean, I'll still say that this is not a good deck to play. Yeah, so the best queen did a good job on the Reshiram and Charizard. I think that's the only reason why we win this game, because the opponent has tech queen GX that gives out 3 prize cards. So yeah, conclusion is still not a recommended deck to play with, but I guess if you want to try something new... It's a new mechanism, so you can try it. And it's not limited to camera up and best play in. There are still a few Pokemons on standard that can use tackle attack. And you can actually use it for this deck also. They maybe give a bit of variation of like Pokemons that can hit the opponents on weakness. So yeah, that's all for today's game. Thank you all for watching and see you guys again next time. Bye-bye.